In the next few minutes, we will be looking at how the flexible credit bid system enhances your experience with software next generation firewalls. As you purchase NG Firewall credits, you receive an activation email that takes you to Palo Alto Network's customer portal. This portal has been designed to give an effective snapshot of purchase credits, where they are allocated and how many credits are consumed at every moment. Credits are consumed with deployment profiles. Prisma NG Firewall credits can be used for deploying VM series on public cloud and CN series container firewalls. For all other deployments, including private cloud, virtual NG Firewall credits will be used. For PanOS versions 10.03 and before, you will be choosing a VM series firewall model. For PanOS versions 10.04 and later, you are no longer restricted with fixed firewall models. The system allows you to choose the number of CPUs that you want to deploy the firewall with. The model provides additional flexibility in letting you choose the security services that you want to deploy on your firewall. You can choose any combination of service as your use case demands. You can also use the same credits for licensing Panorama. Once the profile is created, an auth code is generated. This auth code can be used to license as many number of firewalls as specified in the deployment profile. On the deployed firewall, you can activate licenses by providing this auth code. This can be done from the firewall UI on Panorama or bootstrapped for automated deployments. As the firewall registers it itself with the support portal, you can see that now it's licensed with the services that you chose on the deployment profile. The support portal keeps track of active firewalls and now you will see the credits that are consumed by this registered firewall. It keeps track of the number of firewalls registered under the deployment profile as well as the number of CPUs that are utilized. There are two ways a firewall can be deregistered. One way is to do it from the customer support portal itself. You can also do it directly from Panorama or from the firewall user interface. As soon as the firewall is delicensed by either of the ways, the credits are returned to the pool and are ready to be used for a different firewall or security service. This way, the model allows you to maximize your return on investments with the use of flexible credits. Thank you. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day.